What's up guys, it's Josh and it's Wednesday, so we're gonna show you what's in the shop. We'll start with this Mustang beside me. This is a GT 5.0, but under the hood, we've got a big supercharger, so that's exciting. This car got front end protection with Expel Ultimate Plus. So everything that you see here, this is an aftermarket hood. So we had to do a custom installation there. And same with that front carbon fiber splitter. We did Expel Stealth down there, custom cut to fit that piece. It's also getting a Ceramic Pro Gold package. Over here, we've got a Corvette Z06, a C7, not a C8 this time, but there's always a Corvette here somewhere. This one got front end protection also with Expel Ultimate Plus, and it is also getting a gold package. So Jimmy's just finishing the paint correction. This one had a lot of micro scratches and swirls that we had to get out of there first. Over here, we've got a Chevy Impala that was unfortunately in an accident, but we had to recoat some of the panels on that car. So it was curing, it is now finished and ready to go home. This car you probably remember from last week, the McLaren 620R. This thing is finally done. We wrapped every inch of exterior painted surface and carbon fiber surfaces that you see. We also replaced this R back here. So the owner of the car uh, requested that we do this. This comes in blue only. There's no option to change the color from factory. He wanted it to match the McLaren orange color that the rest of the graphics are done with. So we found that 3M bright orange matched almost perfectly. So we, we removed and replaced that. We also wrapped the small R down here. That was blue. We wrapped that to match the orange. There's gonna be a full video on this car, an overview of sort of what makes this car special. There's only 350 of them in the world. So make sure you subscribe to our channel so you can catch that video when it comes out. Marshall is currently working on a Kia Forte remote start system. It's got everything torn apart there. Is it what's in the shop? Yeah. I'm not wearing my sweater. Nobody look! And Renee and Aaron are installing the final piece on the front end protection for this Tesla Model Y. This is the second Model Y we've had in here in a couple of weeks. These cars are really cool. It's got the pure white interior. Look at this. I imagine this is probably not fun to keep clean, but it looks awesome. Elon, we could use a free shop Tesla if you're watching. Tyler's working on a Grand Cherokee. This one's getting a full detail package. Now this was ceramic coated before, uh, but the full detail is gonna get us the engine bay, the whole exterior wash and clay bar, and in this case, since it was coated, we'll use our ceramic spray as sort of a booster. I think the wheels, of course, he's getting in every crack and crevice with a brush right now. This car actually belongs to my brother-in-law who happens to be a real estate agent. So check out Brian Getty Realtor on Facebook if you're looking to buy or sell property. And we've got a Toyota Venza. This is the new Venza. I wanna say this might be the first one that we've seen. It's pretty cool looking. And this one's here for heated seats. So you can see we have no seats in the car. That's because we are ripping them apart over there to install our heated seat pads. And in the tin bay, we've got a Toyota Tundra. Brandon must have seen something he didn't like in that window, so he ripped it off to make sure that it is perfect when it leaves. We always want to catch stuff before it goes to the customer. We're going to revisit the Impala because Terrell just reminded me that we also tinted all the windows on this car while it was here this time, including full windshield with a UV and heat rejecting film that's called Expel XR Plus. And so, there we are, we tinted that thing. It's a snowy day in Pennsylvania. I love snow, so that's a good thing. Outside, we've got lots of tin. I think we're tinting 13 or 14 cars today. This brand new Cadillac is from the dealership. That one got the front windows tinted. This Tacoma is next in line. Looks like somebody's got it remote started. Tinting the front windows of that as well. And over here, looks like this truck was bought from our friends down at Laurel Valley. It's a new body style Ram Bighorn. This one's here for tint as well. So. That's it for what's going on at this shop. We're gonna head down to our secondary shop and show you what's going on there, because it's packed. All right, guys, we're over at the other shop, and this project is pretty cool. This is a Can-Am Maverick X3, which I don't know a whole lot about other than it's the turbo engine, and this thing looks like a freaking blast to drive through the woods. This thing's getting some vinyl. So you guys remember the big truck we just vinyl wrapped in orange and black and gray? This is the same guy, and he wants to wrap this piece and the doors on the side in that same camo. So when he's hauling this thing with his trailer and that truck, everything matches, which is super cool. 
We've got a Mercedes-Benz GLK 350. We're gonna finish this one up this afternoon. This is a backup camera integration into the factory radio. It didn't have one. We're adding that and we can utilize that factory screen. Over here, this Wrangler is getting a sound system. We're installing a head unit and speakers basically all the way around with an amplifier. We're using some Focal speakers and a Focal amp for that as well. And this is the demo vehicle. Uh, you'll see us driving this around. We upfitted this for Megan, and this is for sale and available today. It's fully upfitted. We've got a Phoenix light bar set up, Phoenix lighting all around the back, Phoenix lighting in the push bar. We've got the full cage. This is unlocked, yeah, perfect. Full cage with the containment bar system and the belts. So this thing is ready to go. Your department could have this as early as probably tomorrow. Put some graphics on it and no waiting in line for that. With that being said, there's two more interceptors right behind John here. These are both getting full outfits also. So one of these is already sold and accounted for. The other one will be ready to go to its new home once it's upfitted. So our goal here is to try to get departments, cars very quickly so you don't have to sit on a long waiting list anymore. And that's it for what's going on at the other shop and at this shop. Thank you guys very much for watching. If you enjoy seeing what's going on, make sure you subscribe to our channel and give us a thumbs up. Thanks, we'll see you next week.